Concept. Jeff Bezos' origin story film where his mother's chased off a cliff by a horde of angry Amazon workers. Hey, man, the idiots are all gonna go down the Little League field to laugh at baseball fanatics. Who's coming? Explain Kingdom Hearts. Well, it's a fun game for ten-year-olds, except there's constant existential dread and multiple people being ruthlessly murdered and the ever-looming threat that your friends will turn on you against their will. Oh, and Mickey, Donald, and Goofy are there. Donald dies in one scene. It, is, is the Kingdom Hearts fandom okay? We've never been okay. Guys, <laughs> watch his hair blatantly intersect with the lockers. So my college animation professor worked on Jimmy Neutron, and he was just like... Listen, yeah, we knew. We just didn't have the time or money to care. The power would go out the studio at least once a week, and they would have to just leave until it came on the next day. Jimmy Neutron's production team saw some shiz. I had a guest speaker come to my class that worked on Jimmy Neutron as an animator and said it was basically a fever dream. I think we need a documentary slash oral history about the making of Jimmy Neutron. Yeah. Dude, stop telling me to count Dracula. I've only ever seen the one. That's why they keep telling you, you haven't counted the others. ADHD is really just like me in the middle of a breakdown still crying. Ooh, I should redesign this OC of mine. It's really annoying to get bored of your emotional breakdown while you're having an emotional breakdown. Me, impatient as trauma is actually happening. Oh, fuck, I'm gonna have to wade through the five stages over this again? Can I just like, you know, skip it? I don't zone out. Being zoned out is my default state, and I occasionally zone back in to check how things are going. Reality is just one of the hundreds or so tabs I keep running at any given time. Ah, you! You get it. You're NB, but you call yourself a bitch. Bitch is a female dog, by the way. Why? I am on the floor! Didn't you know bitch and bastard are gendered terms, and thus you must use the neutral bitchard? Please, a bitchard was my father. Just call me dick. When I was 12, I got banned from Yahoo Answers, and when I emailed support to be like, what did I do, I got a really vague answer that just said, you know what you did. And it still haunts me to this day. I throw pies at short people asks, how tall are you? This is a direct threat. Attention everyone! Horny Bard is cancelled! We're bringing the dad bard to the table! Bardic inspiration? Because I believe in you, champ. Vicious mockery? It's all dad jokes. Seducing NPCs? Nope, we're using persuasion to get them to give you information you need because I'm not angry, I'm just disappointed. Jack of all trades? Yeah, your old dad knows a little bit about everything. Song of rest? It's called tucking you in and giving you a bedtime story. And be the one to split up party treasure and tell them that this is their allowance. Mix up your game, put your pot in a polo shirt and cargo shorts, hit that party with some big dad energy. But guys, dad bard with the dad bard. Guys, did I ever tell you about the time I completely accidentally ruined a professionally made campaign for D&D and thanks to a single roll? Please explain. Okay, so we had to fight our way to the bottom of a castle to stop a group of cultists from summoning an orc god to the world, and we got there, and the ritual was already going. So I ran up to the god, who had already begun to manifest, and cast Finger of Death, which kills any target it touched if they fail a fortitude roll. Since he was a god, he had good constitution and would have certainly survived. Except the DM rolled a one, and the god exploded. <laughs> Oh, that's good shit. I love it. What if I get inside your mind and make you gay and then leave? I won't let you leave. Well, what am I supposed to do in here? Do it again. Make me gayer. Hey, shout out to every Pokemon in Mystery Dungeon that can only speak in caps. <laughs>